Hi, I'm Amy, and this is a quick video about how to delete unwanted tags in Weebly. I got this question from my client, Richard Wilbur, who runs a life coaching business in Wisconsin. And we're looking at his blog and noticing that self-development was spelled in two different ways. So it has generated two categories on his blog, which is a little redundant, to uh, remove the unwanted tag, which is the second one with the hyphen, we're going to go into his site and remove that unwanted tag from the post that it's attached to. Category tags in Weebly are generated simply by the tags that are attached to every post. Now we don't know which post has that unwanted tag, but there's an easy way to find out by simply clicking on it. So we click on the self-development and we see that it is the letting go post that has that tag. So I'm in Chrome and I've got Richard's website open in one tab, but I've already logged in and I have his website open in the editing view in a separate tab. And this allows me to very quickly toggle back and forth between the two. So in the editor, I'm going to navigate to his blog page and I'm going to just scroll down or do a search to look for the letting go of letting go post. Remember, that's the one that we found that has the uh, unwanted tag. So in the editor, we have found the post we want to work with. I'll just click once to get into it. And I don't need to do much editing here because what we're looking for is actually over in this lower left-hand corner. So we've got a message here about some uh, post options. I'll go ahead and dismiss that. And I want to click on the post options button to get to those category tags. Just click once on that and it opens this panel with some different options. And here under categories, we see self-development as a tag, and we can delete it by clicking the little X in the right-hand corner. So I'm gonna click that X. It has been removed. I can close the post options panel. And now I just wanna make sure that I update this post. I've made a change to it, and I wanna click update to make sure that change is saved. So we click update and we get our friendly post published dialog box. Now, in editing posts, I've noticed that sometimes you have to also click publish to republish the site once you've made a change. I'm not sure when that's needed. It seems to be sometimes and not others, but let's just go ahead and click publish to make sure. All right, looks good. I'm gonna dismiss this dialog box and I'm just gonna to go to my tab up at the top of the browser to click on the public side of the website. In this case, we're not, we don't see these tags, so to see our change, I'm gonna click on blog to go back to the main blog page, and now I'm going to click refresh or reload on the browser. This varies a little depending on what browser you're using, but every browser has this feature where you can reload a page. So I reloaded it and now I'm going to scroll down and let's see if that tag is still there or not. Okay, so this is a very good example. We've got our uh, wanted tag of self-development without the hyphen and our unwanted tag has been removed. So there's a very simple quick look at how to remove categories that uh, show up that you don't want. Thank you for watching.